My name is Ted Rhyme, and I uh, operate the HAL freestanding unit in HAL, New Jersey. Um, we are about uh, 30 minutes from 15, 30 minutes from the from the East Coast, where uh, Hurricane Sandy came, and I think it also presented us with some opportunities to um, help the community. These these people that we're we're bringing food to, um, they're used to getting cold hot dogs and cold hoagies, and when we show up with with a hot meal, um, you can see them just really get ready to break down. Um, you talk about emotional connections and Raven fans. I mean, this is something that uh, the customers in, in this area are going to remember for the rest of their lives. Uh, the operators here in the community uh, reached out uh, about some specific opportunities in their area, ways that they could, they, they wanted to serve their community uh, in ways that were beyond the capacity of what their restaurants could do. Uh, thankfully, we were able to, uh, to pull things together and use the Chick-fil-A food truck uh, to supply and distribute food uh, to folks all along the shoreline in the disaster areas uh, here in New Jersey as well as in Staten Island. We'll end up doing about 15,000 sandwiches uh, due to the operator relationships uh, with uh, those in their community. Uh, I'm Eddie Taylor, I'm the Regional Marketing Consultant for the uh, Northern Region and uh, just wanted to share uh, what an amazing opportunity this is uh, for uh, the Northern Region operators, specifically here in Philly and New Jersey and Delaware, to come together to just really love on this uh, Howell, New Jersey uh, community, the, the surrounding area in general. I'm Josh McGrory of Warrington Crossing Chick-fil-A Freestanding Unit in uh, Warrington, Pennsylvania, just north of Philadelphia. Uh, down here helping the guys out with uh, making sandwiches for the victims of Hurricane Sandy. Uh, a lot of people down here still trying to recover and uh, get life back to, to normal, so to speak, uh, weeks after the storm. A lot of us up in our area, uh, you know, we dealt with it for a few days. I had no power personally at our house for a couple of days at the store for uh, a day. But uh, these folks are going on weeks now. Um, been really tough on them so we, we have an opportunity to help out and um, even if it's with a warm meal and a, and a, and a smile and uh, showing them that people out there that care so uh, it's pretty neat to be here with all the other operators uh, from the area helping out and seeing some guys do some things they haven't done in a long time and um, yeah yeah that's uh, that's uh, we're here to show them that, that people care outside of their neighborhood we're out there we're, we're feeling for them we're uh, we're thinking about them and to do what we can to help them out.